Well, dang it, I stumbled into another rabbit hole. So let's start the story here. I have a buddy named Baja who watched the, <laughs> the dead internet theory videos that I did before. And that got them curious and very aware to pick up on things that seem a bit out of whack. So they were watching the movie trailer for the upcoming indie horror movie Tarot when suddenly they noticed a comment that seemed out of place with 28 replies. Oh boy, what could this be? Well, hallelujah! The Daily Jesus devotional has been a huge part of my transformation. God is good. Was owning a loan of $47,000 to the bank for my son's brain surgery, Oscar. Now I'm no longer in debt after I invested $8,000 and got my payout of mm, $270,500 every month. God bless Renee Marie Harrison. Now you might be wondering, what does this have to do with the horror movie about tarot? I, you get, you, you got me. I don't, I don't fucking know. It could be a bot, could be a person. I don't know. It's a good bit so far. I gotta admit, I'd laugh if I saw this just random post on a horror video. But let's look at the reply, shall we? Hello, how do you make such monthly? I'm a born Christian and sometimes I feel so down ow, of myself because of my low finance, but I still believe in God. Thanks to my co-worker, Alex, who suggested Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb. Get that name ingrained into your system. That is that is the subject for today. She's a licensed broker in the States. That's, that's a completely different person. Okay. After I raised up the 325k trading with her, I bought a new house and a car here in the States. Also paid for my son's surgery, Oscar. Glory to God. Shalom. Wow, that's nice. She makes you that much. Please, is there a way to reach her services? I work three jobs and trying to pay off my debts for a while now. Please help me. Great to see you guys talking about her. She changed the game for me. May God bless Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb services. She has changed thousands of lives globally. For the record, uh, Mary Elizabeth Webb works mostly in Chicago. We'll get to that later though, but I find that really funny. Finding yourself a good broker <laughs> is the same as finding a good wife, which you go less stress. You get just enough with so much a little effort of things. <laughs> oh boy. Hallelujah, God is still working wonders. I placed myself in position for such miracles. The best thing I've seen today on YouTube. Thanks a lot. Just to remind you, this is on, this is on this. This is on this. The fuck is this doing on this? Well, thank you so much. I'm really fascinated about investing and I'm lucky I saw your comment. I will look up for her and drop a message. You really inspired me. Please, can I sign in from Australia? Is it possible? This is just, I'm not gonna read out that number. In fact, I'm gonna censor a little bit because I don't, I don't want people getting any ideas. Copy it this way. YouTube is frustrating. What's APK? Oh, 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 no, oh, no. Same, I met Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb last year for the first time at a conference here in Manchester. And after that, my family changed for good. God bless Mrs. Renee, what? I have made more than 90K. God bless Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb. God bless America. Yeah! I started t with Mrs. Mary Webb in 2021 and now my life is good, something to write home about. I thank God the most. He alone made it possible for the opportunity to come my way. It's a miracle. And I would testify 110K bucks every four weeks. I now have a big mansion and can now afford anything and also supports God's work and the church. Please, who is this Mrs. Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb? <laughs> Mrs. Mrs. Her good reputation already speaks for her 100K last month. Her 100K. She's a licensed broker in the States. I have heard about her excellent trading expertise in CNBC News. Guess she's more popular in the United Kingdom. Hold that thought. Oh, I guess it was just a limited time broadcast. So you're probably asking, the fuck's going on here, Pat? Why, why are you even talking about this? I fell into this rabbit hole and I figured you all needed to join me. But what I find fascinating about this is this seems 
not really AI involved. I think this is more like an actual group kind of fucking with people. But here's the thing, and here's the shocker. It's not Mary Elizabeth Webb. I don't even think Mrs. Webb knows this is going on. What this seems like is a targeted way to dupe more naive people into a fake broker program because, hey, money can't really buy happiness, but boy howdy, can it buy us the food to keep us alive? Unless you're one of those really smart people that knows how to self-sustain and grow crops, and if that's the case, good on you. It's really cool. I don't have the motivation for that, but I'm glad you do. So Baha and I were going back and forth on what we could figure out with this person. So did a little hop on Google, typed in that name and clicked on the first link and we got BOOM! Th this is a site. Sure do be a site. Oh god, it's powered by WhatsApp. Now I already have my suspicions because usually stockbrokers, <laughs> it's gonna sound mean to say, they usually have the money to do a better website if they have their own personal website. So I got a little curious because I know Morgan Stanley. Morgan Stanley is an actual broker company here in the States. But I want to stay on Mary first. I want to see if this is actually Mary. So the first thing I checked was that address and uh, not, nothing really shows up there. Gonna give that the benefit of the doubt though because that around it does have like actual other uh, investors and business attorneys and stuff like that. So it's possible that she works in like a firm that just doesn't get tagged on Google Maps. That's fine. So let's play around with something a little more serious because brokers usually do have a direct line of contact. So there's a phone number there. Just type that number into Google and oh, there's, there's no one there. Though for some reason Google wants me to look up cake recipes. I'm on to you, Google. So now you're probably on the suspicious side like me. Like, okay, this definitely seems not legitimate. I gotta figure out if there is an actual Mary Elizabeth Webb that works for Morgan Stanley. Please let that be the case. And as it turns out, there is. You get past the fake website and Mary Elizabeth Webb the singer, look at that. Morgan Stanley. You just click on that website and hey, you want to find the way of fucking shocking here. That's not the same lady. That's an entirely different lady. What's going on here? I'm happy to say that this is the actual Mary Elizabeth Webb. Street address is the same, so I'm going to assume, yeah, it's probably just something they don't have on the map. But the direct number, if you search it, it actually goes back to Mary Elizabeth Webb. So it took a sigh of relief to realize that, okay, this person does exist. And then that sense of dread came in that the website we found originally and the comments were talking about the fake Mary Elizabeth Webb. The first site, the WhatsApp powered site. So I had to do one last thing before I could solidify and I got started on this video. I had to look up that image of that person who wants to be Mrs. Mary Elizabeth Webb. You wanna guess what the uh, results were? What the results were? D take time to comment on the guesses and then you can edit the reaction of like, did you call or did you not call it? You ready? It's a fucking bitch child attorneys in Tulsa, Oklahoma article. It's, just, it's stock footage. And I know this because other websites use it. There's another article by Kev's Best for five best criminal attorneys in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Bankruptcy law. And th this, I, I can't read that, but it's this. I'm going to lose my mind. Now the final reason why I decided to go down this rabbit hole because one of the comments in the daddy internet theories was that, well, sometimes humans can pull this crap too. And guess what, they, they're right. Guess why everybody wins. Everybody wins except people who get tricked into following these scam ass websites. My final piece of advice, if you, Sam, you right there. Hi Sam, how you doing? If you're watching horror movie trailer clips and in that moment you'd realize, boy howdy, I could use a stockbroker in my life. Please just go to actual websites and not the Christian sock puppet accounts on the YouTube comments that are praising this fake Mary Elizabeth Webb, who is also named Renee. Who the fuck is Renee?